Hey, this is Brett, and this 2018 Ram 3500 Crew Cab Long Box Dual Rear Wheel Tradesman is stock number 13768Z. I am here at Summit Automotive in Fond du Lac, Wisconsin, your new and used heavy duty truck and Ram headquarters. This 2018 Ram 3500 has the 6.7 liter high output Cummins diesel engine. Puts out 385 horsepower, 930 foot-pounds of torque, and it's paired up with the ICE and heavy-duty six-speed automatic transmission. This truck has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop, has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off, and it is 100% ready to go. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video, inside, underneath, start it up, and take a look under the hood to give you the most accurate representation possible. Max Steel Metallic is a color. I shoot all my videos in 4K. And if you like the video, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel, which is youtube.com slash summit auto. Click the bell notifications. You'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube. This one comes with the steel wheels with the chrome covers, and it has Lofin XFIT LT23580 R17s. And I would say they have right around half the tread left on them in the front here. Frame and underbody is in really nice, clean condition. Front fender is in nice condition as well. Headlight lenses are crystal clear. Front bumper is in fantastic condition. I didn't see any major dents or dings on there. And the hood is in really nice shape. I didn't see any major dents on there. It does come with the cab lights up top. Passenger side front fender is in pretty nice condition. And the passenger side front wheel simulator is in nice condition as well. Max Steel Metallic, one of my favorite colors. Got a little bit of purple, blues, greens. Really a cool color during the day it looks blue. The afternoon it looks gray and at night it looks black. So that's a really cool color. As you go down this side of this 2018 Ram 3500, take note of how clean that body is, how reflective and mirror-like that paint is. Take these HD videos, so if you are far away or even if you're close by and you just cannot make the trip down, but you're still interested in purchasing the vehicle, you can see the truck, hear the truck, and have confidence in what you're looking at before you even get here. So when you do get here, there's absolutely no surprises and you can make a smart and informed buying decision from wherever you're at. If this video helps you make a smart buying decision, let your salesman know that you saw the video, that it was helpful and that Brett sent you. Back wheel simulator is in nice shape and the back tires have just as much tread as those front tires. Frame and underbody is in pretty nice condition back here as well has all the remaining factory exhaust, so it hasn't been altered in any way. And the lower rockers and cab corners look fantastic as well. Dually tubs in pretty nice shape. Got just a couple little rock chips and stuff, but nothing too bad. Didn't see any major dents on there. Coming around in the back, there is one little ding on the rear bumper, but it doesn't affect the performance of the truck. Full towing package, of course, which includes receiver hitch, four pin and seven pin wiring. And the tailgate is in very nice condition. Does have the locking tailgate. Spray in bed liner, that's a Linux spray in bed liner. I have the same bed liner in my truck, I love it. Has the fifth wheel and gooseneck prep package and you get seven pin wiring back here. The bed itself is in really nice shape. And that spray in bed liner goes onto the tailgate, which is a nice feature as well. Coming around to the driver's side, Julie tub's in okay shape. Got a couple little marks on it, but nothing too bad. Back uh, wheel is in nice shape as well. And down the rest of the side, cab and doors look fantastic. And it's like that all the way down the side. I didn't see any dents or dings. Paints in pretty nice shape. Has the heated fold up tow mirrors. They fold up like so, have built in directional signals, and they fold in like that. Inside the tradesman package gives you the work grade gray vinyl interior, 40, 20, 40 split bench seating in the front. No rips or tears on the seats. They're in really nice condition. Has the heavy duty rubber floors, auto headlamps, power windows, locks, and mirrors. Back seats are just as clean as the front seats. No rips or tears back here. It does have the latch child safety system for any child car seats you may have and the fixed glass rear window. These seats do fold up 
and there is storage underneath here. You do get in-floor storage with removable bins. For easy cleaning, you can put ice and drinks in there. It's like you have too many coolers wherever you go. Or if you're not in Wisconsin, just extra storage space. And that floor is in really nice condition as well. You do get the child safety locks on the back doors and the inside and bottoms of the doors all look really good. We'll hop inside in just a second. I'll show you the VIN sticker real quick. As well as the tire and loading information sticker. All right, let's hop inside. Check out the miles, the radio, and everything that this truck has to offer on the interior. Didn't mean to start it there. Don't want to smoke myself out of here. Anyways, 54,187 miles on here. Digital speedometer, outside temperature display, instrument cluster is very nice and clean. You do get information center controls on the left, cruise controls on the right, six-speed automatic ISIN transmission with the optional tap shift. This one has the AM, FM, and Sirius XM radio capabilities, Climb, climate controls, factory brake controller, stability control, tow haul, and your factory exhaust brake. You do get your 4x4 shifter right there and your cup holders. Passenger side floor mat and seat are in fantastic condition. No rips or tears on there. And the headliner is in very nice condition on this truck. And you get, I believe it's in, maybe not an auto dimming mirror, but there's your rear mirror. All right, now we'll start it up and take a look under the hood. Starts right up, no check engine lights or anything like that. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today. And hopefully from this HD video, you've been able to verify the quality and condition of this truck all the way around inside and out. These lights are working nicely. Under the hood, we have the 6.7 liter high output Cummins diesel. 385 horsepower, 930 foot-pounds of torque. Engine bay is very clean, runs very smooth. And once again, this truck has been fully safety and inspected by our service shop. It has a fresh oil and filter change. All the fluids have been checked and topped off, and it is 100% ready to go. There's the emission sticker. And I would highly recommend this truck from a quality and condition standpoint, considering the age of miles on it. And to see more pictures of this truck or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, half tons, three quarter tons, one tons, you name it, we got to go to that website right there, summitauto.com. Full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. If you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto, click the bell notifications, you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day, as well as having access to one of the largest catalogs of vehicle walkarounds on YouTube. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel at the left. Link to more Ram 3500 truck videos I've done in the upper right. Link to this vehicle on our website in lower left. And a link to one of our latest YouTube videos in lower right. Click those, check us out. We're super excited to help you with this Ultra Clean 2018. Ram 3500 Crew Cab Long Box Dually. Tradesman Edition with the Ison Heavy Duty Transmission. High Output Cummins in Maximum Steel Metallic. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.